Hello everyone. Here is a question based on oxidation states. In KO2, what is the oxidation state for potassium? KO2 is a superoxide. In superoxides like KO2, the oxygen atoms are in a superoxide ion that is O2 minus. Typically, oxygen has an oxidation state of minus 2, but that is not applicable here. Even for the next case, H2O2. In hydrogen peroxide also it is not applicable and plus potassium belongs to group 1. Group 1 elements always has an oxidation state of plus 1 because once they lose one electron they attain the noble gas configuration. Therefore it is plus 1. So if we put plus 1 for potassium then we have to assume that each oxygen carries an oxidation state of minus half so that the net will be 0 because KO2 is a neutral compound and in neutral compounds the sum of oxidation states must be equal to 0. This means that option 2 is wrong, option 4 is also wrong. So here it is plus 1. Now in hydrogen peroxide we have a peroxide linkage O2 2 minus or the other way to look at it hydrogen typically has an oxidation state of plus 1 with the non-metals. Therefore, 2 times plus 1. Let us assume that we do not know about oxygen. So, 2x. H2O2 is a neutral molecule. So, put it as 0. Therefore, 2x equal to minus 2. This means that x equal to minus 1. So, for oxygen, the oxidation state in hydrogen peroxide is minus 1. This means option 1 is the only correct choice here. Let us cross check it for H2SO4. Once again hydrogen with non-metals has a acceleration state of plus 1. So 2 times plus 1 plus x for sulfur plus 4 times minus 2 because typically for oxygen we put minus 2 and that is equal to 0. Therefore, 2 plus x minus 8 equal to 0. So, x minus 6 equal to 0. Therefore, x is equal to plus 6. So, we do get plus 6. This means option 1 is the only correct choice here. 